Hello everyone and welcome back to Kronos Plays Final Fantasy X. Today, well, we're going to do a little bit more Blitzball, but first we need to recruit some people. Now, I actually already went ahead and got what I was aiming for off screen. Um, so I'll just reload that save when I'm done doing, well, at least showing you what I did. Uh, but first I want to show you the guys that I recruited. And it's pretty standard. If you Google what's the best early Blitzball players you can recruit, these guys show up like 9 out of 10 times. Uh, the first one's usually on everyone's list, and it is this dog right here. His name is Jamal, and he is a really, really dope goalie. Uh, sign player. Now, you'll at least need these guys for three matches, so I'll just do three here. Um, I'm not going to be playing three matches. Well, I'm not going to show three matches because I've already done that, but I'm going to show you what we need to do. Uh, the second player that I get, it's not on everyone's list, but I like putting this guy as my middle fielder because he can steal pretty much any... Well, anytime like he gets into like a, a break, he can attack them and steal the ball. It is this dude. I don't know what it's pronounced. Zalitz, maybe? And three. There you go. Now, the next player that you might, might want to get is... Uh, he's a shooter. If you're gonna cheese, like, the games, though, like, if you're just gonna score and hide behind the net, you don't need him. He's really good if you're actually gonna play the games yourself, but if you're not gonna play it, don't don't waste the money. Like, just have Titus do a jack shot or a sphere shot and then hide behind your net. That's all you need to do. Anyways, this is the guy I'm talking about. It's Wedge. Uh, the dude next to him is Biggs as well. He's not as good, at least not early game. Um, which, yes, we need to get rid of someone. Uh, Datto. Actually, I think I usually place you with him anyways. Yeah, this is Biggs over here. He's not as good as Wedge. Go figure, I guess. But, you know, there's big, that's the Biggs and Wedge of Final Fantasy X. Now, in here, we don't really need to come here just yet, but I do want to come back here and get the Jupiter Crest. That's going to be involved with Waka, I believe, in the future. All right, so, at the save points now, we can play Blitzball. We go to Blitzball. What we want is a tournament. There, it's grayed out at the moment. Well, how we need to do, oh, how we need to get that activated is come to the screen and cancel. Then do that one more time. And just cancel again. And play Blitz. Now the tournament should be on, oh, one more time. Gotta be three times, right, 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 right. And on the fourth time, it should be unlocked. There it is. Oh, second place super goalie, huh, interesting. Ooh, a return sphere, that, fudge, I got a rename card. That would be tempting as well to get. Return sphere, uh, it pretty much allows you to return back to a, a point on your grid. Say if I had a return spear, I could go down like say, oh, I mean, I couldn't do that right now. But if I had additional lock, like lock spheres on the lock one spheres, I could go down to like Riku's path, then go all the way up to Riku's path and get, uh, I mean, I think I messed that up. Go down to Lulu's path, go all the way up to Riku's path and get like stale and use and then return to Lulu's path with Kamari. Uh, that's something we can do later on when it's easier. We'll get a different one, too. I think it's called, like, Friend Sphere, where it allows you to teleport to a, a friend's node. Uh, but yeah, anyways, we want the first place, place prize, which is Attack Reels. That's Waka's Overdrive. It's fairly good, too, compared to his elemental... Oh! <laughs> we only need... We only need to actually do two matches in this one. We get seated. Interesting. Uh... All right, well, eh, crap, Albed Sykes gets seated too. That's the team you want to look out for, the Albed Sykes, because they, uh, they're stupidly good. Like, they are overpowered. Their goalie, as I was saying last time, uh, Nimrook. Wow, the Ronso Fangs just destroyed them. Huh. Um, yeah, their goalie, Nimrook, has, like, the highest goalie catch stat. And it is just insane. Continue playing, because I didn't actually play yet. God dang it, game. Alright, so we're going up against the Luka Goers. That shouldn't be too bad. We want Titus. We want Wedge. We want Zalitz. We want, I guess, these guys. Yeah. And... 
actually don't know. Uh, hmm. Who do I want? Boda? Can I back out? No, I can't back out. Alright, well, just do Letty and, and Jamal there. And no. So we do Wedge or Petis Wedge. A pass and attack. I might want to do these. I want. I want Zalitz there. Attack's good, but passing's important as well. Yeah, Jasu and Boda I think are better. And then we want. Look at Keepa. Now look at Jamal. 14 catch. And this dog actually learns. Uh, super goalie actually, which is also really good tech for him to have. So we want that. That's gonna be our team for now. Uh, set techs, we have all that we can set. We're not going against the uh, Albed Sykes. If we were going against the Albed Sykes, I'd switch out Jet Shot for Sphere Shot to get past Nimrook's goddamn catch score. Now, set mark. This is something we... Well, I didn't go over last time. I kind of explained learning techs a little bit wrong. Uh, how you learn techs is you set a mark, and then whenever this person they're marked to, or tracking, uses their skill, you'll be prompt to press a button, that will allow you to learn a skill. It can come in like handy, obviously. Um, they also learn skills based off their own levels, so don't worry too much about it if you're not very good. They'll learn the skills they need for the most part. There are some really good ones, though. Alright, let's go ahead and start. If my cat would start scratching that. Thank you, dog. Who is a cat. Now, we don't get the ball, and... You know, really should have realized my cat was about to jump on me as he was scratching right next to me. Alright, so we want to steal this ball. We should be able to. Ooh, one man break. Well, yeah, just... Oh, am I... Okay, I can't aim auto. I want to get this ball down to... Well, no one, actually. Goddamn. Well, whatever. I want to get the ball to Tita so he can score, or I can get it to Wedge so he can score as well. Oh wow, he actually broke. Wow, you actually survived that. That's incredible. You're not going to survive this one, but there's too many people, yeah, with too much block. But with the amount of attack power I have and the two defensemen in the back, again, this should not be a problem. Steal that ball again, and then instantly... Crap. Pass. Didn't think, I thought he swam out of my circle for a second. I'm not that good at this game, by the way. I'm not sure if you know that. Come on, Jasu. Jasu, you suck! Now, if you want to hold off on getting the attack rails until later on in the game, by all means, that is, like, a lot easier to do. You'll have better players. You'll have just better skills. What's my pass on this guy? It's, uh... Not too bad. Let's pass to Wedge, because he's closer. And then we want to go up there and pretty much try to shoot. We'll try to break first. Yeah, that's a chance, but it's a chance I'm willing to take. That's a chance I failed that. Yeah, so Wedge, he's a really good early game shooter. You don't need him, like, at all, because if you're going to just be using Tidus, you don't need anyone else. This actually might be a goal on Wedge, though, or from Wedge. Let's pass the ball. Good catch. Swim a little bit closer. Oh, he's... No, he didn't... He didn't get me. Sweet. Shoot. That should be a goal, yeah. Nice. Now, if you're gonna cheese the game, go ahead and just swim behind your goal. But we're gonna continue playing for a little bit. Just for a little bit. We're not gonna do all the matches, though I guess there's only Albert Sykes after that, and I wouldn't mind getting a, uh, a return sphere. What happened to Zlitz? Why are you shooting? You're an idiot. That was extremely dumb of you. To Titus? That's gonna be another score on my part. We're gonna do the jack shot. 
Oh, that's a lot of people, though. That's a lot of people. <laughs> All right, so break through to the other side, then shoot, then jack shot. All right, so we'll at least get two down. We lo oh, the lo lo oh, the lowest one, too. Couldn't have been the highest one. Had to be the lowest. This might be stopped. It was. Ah. Oh. That was too many people on his butt. Come on, two man break. Oh, now it's just going to be a straight up break. We get that, and then pass to Wedge, because he has a better, better base shot. And then come in here. Break. Oh, that's a chance. Ah, crap. I don't like how the time stops when we're doing this. When we're doing, like, the menus. I guess you wouldn't really have that much of a chance to do your commands correctly. Jamal's gonna level up, I think, with all these uh, goals he's blocking. Just, uh, Boda. Here you go, Boda. God damn it, Boda. Boda, you suck. What the hell? Why are you on my team? Did I choose the wrong guy? I thought you had high endurance and... Wow. God damn it, Boat. I hate you. No break. Really? That's kind of dumb of you. I would have taken the chance. While he has the higher stats, he does just straight up, like have a chance. Not a big chance, but you do have a chance to survive even if you are outmatched and gunned. Half time! I was gonna shoot. Boo-hoo. So, let's see. Who do we got? Oh, that's the other team. So a lot of levels on your guys' front. There's mine. Zulitz got two levels there. Good job. Nothing really... The right home about, but good job. Just go ahead and put Oh, because your attack? Is that why God fuck you Boda, you damn asshole. Excuse my French. Uh yeah, we want that. Oh, you have this now. What do you got? You got a venom tackle, a nap tackle, and a wither tackle. Uh what's high risk? Oh, God, no. I mean, I guess if you're trying to level up, find yourself a ball. Yes. All right. Anybody else? No. All right. Let's proceed to another round. Now, like I was saying, if you want to hide behind the net, you go right ahead and do that. Um, this game gets a lot more, well, easier and more fun as we further progress into the game. Like, if we can get some better players to start our, like, our conquest with, we'll be fine. Being said, though, like, damn, I was kind of hoping the small one would. Okay, we'll do break and then shoot. Yeah! Might not go in, but, oh, their goalie leveled up and gained an extra point. That's dumb. Mm. Oh well. Um, yeah, as, there's more plays available in there. They're all pretty talented, and after a while, you can get a really good team that makes playing this a lot easier and more fun, I think. But at the same time, right now, it's not fantastic to do this, but Attack Reel is relatively good. And. I'm gonna pa <clears throat> pass to Titus, I think, yeah. Try to do the jack shot, shot, uh, shot again. If I could speak. There's faster players, too, that you can get that make, uh... I guess pass. To... You. And then I want to pass pretty much right back. Thankfully, you got it. I'm going 
gonna pass right to Titus again. I gotta get closer to use the jack shot, because nine's still relatively high to, uh... There's just one? Okay, screw it, sure, shoot. Jack shot. Also kills the time a little bit too. Woo, goal! Now, after your three games are up, your contracts will expire. Um, you can just resign them at that point. Or you could just not, too. Like, you don't have to resign anyone right now. Are you gonna shoot? Oh, I thought you were just dribbling. I was gonna say. That's ballsy. To say the least. You're passing. Well, to me, apparently. Uh, that's not good. Sure, break, pass, venom tackle. Not, not good. Oh, crap, I should have tech copied him. Oh, well, you shooting? You are shooting. You're failing, hopefully. Yeah, yeah, you are. Give it the wedge. Give it the Titus. Why would you give it to Titus? Give it to Wedge. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna have to go with that one because there's no way Titus could pass all the way over there. He barely passed all the way over here. Jesus. Yeah, your uh, your endurance is kind of lackluster there. Oh well. Feel free to shoot again and waste the clock. Oh, you're passing. Really. Now, you can actually get other uh, Blitzball team's members on your team. You just have to wait for their uh, contracts to expire. Once their contracts expire, uh, you can sign them. It's not always easy to do. Pass to you. Yeah, we won't be able to actually do the... Um, the jack shot again shoot of course it's this bastard again ah gonna gonna shoot I mean I'm winning two to zero so I shouldn't really be getting frustrated <laughs> like I'm winning there's the they're not gonna come back they have less than 30 seconds to come like the break or get two scores, and they're not going to do it. That's actually impossible for them to do that at this point. But at the same time, I want to. I want more more score. The high, higher higher number is better. With my ca caveman logic there. The higher the number, the better. But it's it's over. Time up. That could have been a lot worse, I guess. The middle field of dude is gonna. Yeah, they usually get a lot of experience. Jamal get a tech? That probably means you can do super goalie too now. Yeah, I don't think there's any chance that we're gonna get the high score anymore. Well, it's only three actually. If I can get Wedge a few more scores or Titus, we could get that return sphere. But, you know, I'm actually just gonna reload that save from earlier and I'll see you guys over there. Cause yeah, one more match and you get the attack rails. And I actually don't think I recorded when we unlocked it, but it's just the message at the end of the third game. Like, oh, Walker's unlocked his overdrive attack rails. All right, let's head up to the Meehan High Roads. Uh, I should probably show you the attack rails on the menu. This is them, spin multiple attack slots. It's a fairly good overdrive too. Also, give me something. Do you not give me something? I thought, you gave me high potions. There's someone here that gives me high potions. Do I just wait around for them? I mean, I could probably fast forward, right? Maybe they're not coming. All right. I thought there was someone here that gave high potions. Oh, that's disappointing. There's nothing over here. Maybe it's that lady up there. Or this weird looking fellow. Hello. This is a statue. Of Lord Meehan. He looks kind of badass. Eight centuries ago, 
he founded a legion known today as the Crusaders. In just a few short years after their founding, their ranks grew throughout Spira. The maesters of Yevon feared an uprising and accused them of rebellion. Sounds reasonable. The Lord Meehan walked along this very road to go face their charges and refute them. I wonder how that went. He succeeded in winning the Maesters' oh. trust, and his legion became an arm of the Yevon. Oh, is that the guy? It was then that Yevon gave them the name Crusaders, which they have kept ever since. And the rest is history. Dope. You. That's a hunter spear. That's not a high potion. I mean, it's still good, thanks. I can sell it. Anything else? Although this is a high road, fiends do appear. Be on your guard. Huh. Do high roads usually not have fiends? Antidotes. I swore some. Oh! Random encounter! Ha! Huh. That one looks slow. It's also tough. Let me handle this. No way! I can take it! I mean, not wrong. Ha! What the? <laughs> what the? I only did half its health? <laughs> Shocking! Good job, Orin. You have piercing oh, yeah. on your weapon. The best. Kamari has piercing on his I weapon, too. You could have with two attacks. Yeah, Orin, he doesn't have anything kind of like special like Kamari does, either. Uh, he just... He can attack heavily defense things because he has piercing on his weapon. Ooh, a lot more new enemies. Uh, Let's see. Can I... Could probably overdrive two of you. Let's try to. Oh, that's Yuna. My bad, Yuna. Try to get rid of this guy fast so he doesn't. I could have put. We have a cold weapon on. You silly, vanilla. Do not stone me. It's still not legal in this state yet. All right. Well, why did I defend with her? Lulu, come in here and help me. Let's end this. Yes, let's. You can thunder this dog, right? Bear. Need a good jolt. Good job. Uh, Waka, Orin, come in here and slash this blizzard dude. That'll be fully restored. Oh, good job, Orin. You did, like, no damage. Cronus, put on... Null Frost. Next time. Uh, these guys, there are fiends on this road that we can learn some blue magic from. Right, Lulu had the scan on it. Not Lulu, uh, Yuna. Got really confused there for a second. Hey, we overkilled that one too. Actually, yeah, Lulu, come back out here and cure yourself. We don't have to do this after battle. Yeah, there's, I think, Bomb, and I think there's, like, a somewhat rare encounter beast that you can learn, like, Flamethrower from. Wait. That actually doesn't sound familiar at all, now that I say that out loud. No, no, I think so. I know you can learn, I think you can learn, like, Self-Destruct from the Bomb. Anyways, like, in terms of, uh, the blue magics for Kamari... If you miss some, don't worry about it, because there'll be a, a time and a place later on that you can learn all but one of them in a single combat. So just don't worry about it. Get them if you can, and they all kind of suck. What those are <laughs> to be quite honest. Some old city. Correct, a city most ancient. A terrible testament to sin's power. I tremble every time I see them. With excitement, Anderson, right? Humans are mere mud puppies. What does that mean? But I believe humans are the only ones capable of defeating sin. Oh, who else would do it? A good reply. I am relieved to hear you say that, Milady Summoner. Oh? Uh -uh. Where are my manners? I am matron, a scholar. I am matron. service, Milady. I am on a journey, studying the history of our world, Spira, seeking its stories and secrets. My travels have taken me to many places, and I am troubled by what I have seen. Fragile smiles on people's faces, crumbling at the mere mention of sin. Kind of understandable. They are counting on you, milady. Give them a reason to rejoice once more. 
I will. Yeah, I mean, they've been, what, constantly terrorized by the thing? So, of course, if you talk about it, Lady just Yusgard gonna get unhappy. Yeah? Ah. All right, thought you had something else to say. Uh, we'll be talking to him again later. Go ahead and grab this bad Larry. Ice Brand, that's probably good to put on Titus now. Um, there are some things here that are weak to ice. Though 5% strength is relatively good. I'll put on Ice Brand, why not? You could really go with any weapon for a while and not have to worry too much about it. Like... Oh, is this the guy I was looking for? I think it is. So you defend. You get attacked. Uh, you defend as well. You lance it. See if we actually learn anything from it. Fire breath. All right. Okay, cool. Uh, you can leave. And we want to blind it. Bring it on. With the dark. Stay Probably down. should extract ability too. Did that work? That did work. Uh, are you weak to anything? You're not weak to anything, so just hit it with fire. Good job. Uh, Kamari, get out. Titus, have you been in the party yet? I don't know. I don't think you have. Okay. I don't know how much we need to overkill this thing. We probably can't get it, though. Uh, you leave for him. Make way. And yeah, you can attack. See ya! Wouldn't want to be ya! There's probably like a couple of hundred, like maybe even a thousand for that guy. Ooh, I have, yeah. Oh, Flame Tongue! That's useful. There are some enemies coming up that are weak to uh, fire, and Flame Tongue will go a long way with that. Okay, cool. What happened? Oh. This scene, I was like, I didn't, didn't realize we were so close to triggering a cutscene here. Lady Summoner, I presume. No. Yes, I am Yuna. I am Lucille, captain of the Jose Chocobo Knights. And I'm Alma. We've been charged to guard the high road. You look different from, uh, from Zeta Blade Chronicles there have been too. Reports of a large fiend appearing in this area with the taste for chocobos. Do take care, Summoner. So, Yuna. so we're riding him to lure him out. Chocobos. Oh, actually, maybe. Thank you. We will be careful. Good. We should get back to our rounds. Farewell. Our prayers are with you. <laughs> the guy's just like, I, you know, I'm not that important, sorry. A large fiend? Hmm. Let's go get him. Why? Why? Yeah. It's the right thing to do. Well, we could save some chocobos. The right thing to do. They do need the saving. <laughs> What'd I say now? Jekt said that a lot, too. <laughs> and every time he said it, it meant trouble It's a red Roscoe. button issue, a hot topic. Don't, <laughs> don't bring it up, Oren. All right, you already gave us stuff, right? Yeah. I mean, you're not wrong about that, either. Let's go ahead and level up our stuff a little bit. Come up here, get some focus. Now, focus is kind of like, we'll cheer a little bit for black magic. Uh, though It doesn't increase your defense, sadly. Get some health for you. I did not want to return. And we're good to go here. So who's over here? Mental break, oh, that's Orin. So if we wanted to, if we could hold Titus back a lot. To get the orange, which would be kind of, well, not smart. Provokes good. Yeah, that would be very unwise to hold him back to get into orange. No offense to orange, but it's not exactly that great. It's good, not great. We learned life, also really handy. Kamari, you can come back down here, and you're gonna go up there next time. And you have two here. Do I have anything that I want to give to you? I mean, I could give you the MP sphere. That would work. You have a lot of empty ones. Let's move down here for now. Get some health. How much MP do you have? 
Because to be quite honest, I was thinking about giving it to, like, Lulu again so Kamari could have it. You have 30? That's not that much. Alright, you know, that's... That's reasonable. We can do that. We also move from the head one more. Okay, that should be it. Great, how are we doing on the Aeons? But as well as expected, I guess. Alright, who just gained the level? It was Lulu. Of course it was. I mean, can't learn anything just yet. I could have gave you the MP sphere there. But you have enough MP as is. Like a fair amount of MP. Oh, I can't wait till we get down here and get these second level spells. When do you learn Bio? Because that's like another one of my favorite spells. Uh, is this it? Yeah, Bio! That's one of my favorite spells in all Final Fantasy games. Fantastic. All right, hello. Ah, a summoner party. Uh, you too are a summoner? My name is Belgamine. You are? Belgamine, what a Hina. name. Ah, the High Summoner's daughter. I've heard much of you. But you are still fresh on the road, are you not? Yes, I am. I might have a few things to teach you. Hmm? Let us see which are stronger. My Aeons or yours? A one-on-one -on -one match. Not to the death, of course. What do you say? Yes? Hm. I'll do my best. Good. Before we begin... Your Aeons have been healed. You can fight with your full strength. Sweet. Come. So this is a summoner battle. This is kind of a unique battle in the fact that, like, we're going to be going up against Balgamina's summons. Or one of them at the time. Uh, there are other summoners we can face throughout the game. Uh, this is just the first one. She's going to summon Ifrit. So we cannot summon Ifrit. We actually can only summon Balfour. Now, Ifrit is somewhat stronger than Balfour. However, we do have access to... Uh, Ifrit's weakness, which is Blizzard, and we also have a full overdrive for Valfor, so we can kill this thing relatively easily. I don't know how much health it has. Uh, I think it's varied, though, depend on, like, your level. Maybe. But it's not too bad. I don't think we can overkill it, though. I'm pretty much just gonna use Blizzard, and then when I get to, like, yellow health, I'm going to use my Overdrive. We actually get two turns here? Wow. I didn't expect that. So he attacks once, and next... Yeah. And Aeon's attributes raise with those of the summoner, uh, those of its summoner. Thus, the Ifrit 1 summoner calls may be very different from the one called by another summoner. Because it's this Ifrit's strength and HP are both high, it will win in a straight, out, uh, straight fight. Try, boost, uh, try using your Aeon's shield and boost commands. Uh, shield stops your Aeon's overdrive gauge, but reduces the damage the amount of damage it receives. Boost accelerates the overdrive gauge, but increases the amount of damage received. Shield is best when you expect the enemy to hit your Aeon with a powerful attack. The Efe this Efe alternates between attack and meteor strike. A meteor strike is coming up next, so defend your Aeon with shield. So pretty much use shield, or else you might lose. Unless you hit him with the overdrive, then you might win. That's not too bad. Black, Blizzard. Looks like we have a few concurrent turns coming. No, we don't. Never mind. Uh, so we want to shield here. We might not even be able to... Or we might not even have to use Overdrive. If I can't great if i can oh well but it'll work shield uh, okay uh blizzard he's not sagging yet so which i actually don't know if he does sag all right let's just use the overdrive and that should kill him straight up Use Energy Blast, though. Energy Ray is a little on the weaker side. Oh, 
overkill. Oh, we did overkill. I don't think we get anything for it, but we did overkill it. Stop. That is enough. I know, your summon's gone. Yeah, we get nothing. <laughs> oh well. Bad for one so young. I underestimated you. Take this. You've earned it. Whoa. You show promise. Thank you. With more training, you could defeat Sin. Thank you. But I think you might defeat Sin before I am able. Why? We beat her. I cannot. Huh? Or should I say, I was not able to? You mean? Farewell, Yuna. We'll meet again. We will meet again. Hello. Did I already talk to you? Yeah, that's true. All right. So. We got a ring for her, and it's just straight up better. All right, cool. That's going to be it for this episode. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press like below. If you're not subscribed yet, on the end of my video section, check out some of the content and see if it's to your liking. Once again, thank you for watching. We all have a great day.